and I know how draining it is on him when he's practicing. Plus fasting, I wanted to make it a little extra special, so this is what I made. I made it and I got it. Let's try it and rate it 1 through 10. For this series, I do not go verbatim of the recipes that I stitch. I'm just using them as an inspiration. I started by taking a whole mango, peeling it, and dicing it. Then I took half of a medium avocado and I diced it. I already had some pre-cut onions and then I minced some garlic. I put everything in a bowl except for the garlic. I set the garlic to the side. In a bowl, I squeezed a half lime and then I got some salsa from Target. This is my favorite salsa of all time. I then took my garlic and slightly toasted it in a medium high heat pan. Then I took a whole bunch of Kerrygold butter and I put it in there with it. I don't really measure nothing. After letting it cook for a little bit, I separated the butter from the garlic and then I put a little bit of honey and salt in the butter. Now you got honey and garlic butter. I oiled and seasoned my salmon with salt and pepper on both sides, put in the air fryer for 10 minutes on both sides. Lastly, I took the rest of the avocado, sliced it up, and put some salt and lime on it. And now, let's try it and rate it 1 through 10. So I got my garlic butter. I'm going to take it and pour it right on top. Oh, yeah. And I'm trying the Japanese barbecue sauce for the first time. I heard really good things about it. My mouth is watering right now. Rice. Salsa. Boy, avocado. This is a solid 9 out of 10. God bless you. Have an amazing day. That's so